been a long day and a lot of debate on the budget. On climate change, we can't make this transition on our own. Uh, but what the budget is about, is about is giving people the tools to make the transition to a low carbon economy. And there are a list uh, of measures outlined today in the budget. There are a range of supports being put in place in relation to electric vehicles to encourage people to try them out and hopefully purchase a new or second-hand electric vehicle. In relation to smart farming, we're putting incentives in place to encourage farmers to reduce their inputs, to protect our environment and to reduce their overall emissions uh, into our climate. The Renewable Heat Incentive Scheme will hopefully encourage farmers, non-profitable farmers, to start growing biomass. Uh, we have energy efficiency grants for homes and businesses and for those homes that cannot afford to carry out those upgrades, uh, we are putting funding in place for deep retrofits of their homes. For government agencies and departments, uh, we are now saying that if they save money on energy, they can spend that within their own department on their own priorities and we are putting a fund of €9 million Euro in place to assist them uh, in relation to that. On the transport area, we're putting measures in place to get people out of cars, onto bikes and into buses. The task that we have is massive, but working together, I believe that we can do it. In the short term, we're looking at improving air quality, and we must remember that one in five children suffer from asthma. Four people a day are dying as a res direct result of poor air quality. So in the short term, it's about addressing issues like health. In the long term, it's about protecting our planet.